our past projects, we've made a lot of decisions around minimizing regret. So when it came to St. Ignatius, it felt natural to ask ourselves, what would be scarier than standing by watching it fall down? A lot of people ask us, where do you start on a project this huge? You start with the structure, with the bones of the building. This is really the heart of the problem. There's been massive structural damage here. There's a huge hole in the roof. Water has been pouring in for about 20 years. This is the worst spot in the building. There's rotten beams, sagging floors, and collapsing walls. Our challenge is to address this before the winter so that we're no longer in danger of collapse and there's still a building left to save. It's a lot of work, but the good news is that an anonymous donor has pledged a $50,000 matching gift towards the campaign. That's right, which is amazing because that means every dollar you give gets doubled towards raising money to fix the beams, the roof, raising all those floors. Once we address the bones of the building, we can move on to more exciting stuff, like fixing the windows and the doors, and we can start to imagine what this place can become. We envision something like a historic venue with a hotel and opportunities for art, small business, and local community. It'll take years, but with your support, we know it's possible.